Welcome back to How to Angora. Today, we are going to trim our bunny nails. This is Erica. He is a blue-eyed white French Angora. And yes, I said he. The sex, sex change fairy paid us a bit visit. All right. So you can see we have these big fluffy feet. And it is a little hard to see the nails. I've got one arm holding the bunny. I've got another hand trying to wrangle the clippers. I like to use this. This is the mesh that you get at the grocery store with your fruit and veggies. I like to save them, pull them over the feet, and look at that. I can see the nails very, very easily. Sliding one hand from the chest to the foot. And he really doesn't like nail trims. Flip him over again. Tuck his head underneath my armpit. Put the mesh on top. Rabbits have four nails on the back and five on the front. And they got a dew claw. What's nice about a white rabbit is you can see the quicks. I'm try to zoom in on this a little bit. All right. Um, with other color rabbits, you may have to guesstimate. So we just get it and we go clip. And we go clip and clip. Now, if you cut the quick, this first aid is same for a cat or dog. Go ahead, get your cornstarch or your quick stop or whatever you're using and hold it on there till the bleeding stops and go all about on your way afterwards. Easy peasy. All right, now we're going to do the front ones. Uh, there are two ways to do it. I like to leave the bunny upright because they seem to like it better. However, he's already upside down, and for the sake of this video, it'll be easier to see like this. I am holding his chest. Take this opportunity to make sure nobody has sore hocks. You'll notice when they're upside down, if you press on their paw, sometimes they go grabby. They're uncomfortable. It, they're prey animals. This is normal. Just go slow. Be confident and trim those nails so you see the four and then we'll do the new claw so trim clip clip and we'll confirm what the quick is clip Oof. erica he's one of the ones i like to do upright um i've got his can't see it but i've pinned his hips and his hind legs underneath my armpit now we're gonna look for that dew claw. Don't forget that dew claw because it can grow and curve and get into the rabbit's skin. It's no good. This one is short. We don't need to do it. Take this opportunity to feel the paws here. If you feel any crusty, snotty stuff, time to see if anybody has a respiratory infection, if you need vet care, antibiotics, or call them however you handle that in your rabbit tree. All right, so I have one, two, three, and four. Zoom in again. And clip, 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 and now we're going to find that dew claw. And whoop, this one's nice and short too, so we don't have to worry about that. And Erica, buddy, you're all done. Thanks for watching, guys.